Welcome to Aarti's Education. Today we are going to learn how to solve problem set 38. Before we start, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe my channel. So let's start our problem set here. The question is, read the decimal fraction and write <coughs> down the place value of each digit. Our first decimal fraction is 6.13. This is the reading of this decimal fraction, 6.13. Now we are going to write the place value of each digit in this fraction. Let's write it in our notebook. Six point one three. So here 6 is in the unit place so the value of 6 is 6 because it is in the unit place now let's take next number it is 1 each and every number after decimal point is a fraction so we are going to write the place value of 1 as a write 0 for 6 then give a decimal point here and then write 1. Place value of 1 is 0 0.1. Now next number is 3. We are going to write it as 0 for 6. Then decimal point 0 for 1. And then we are going to write it. Now its place value is 0 0.03. Look, it's very easy. You just have to write zeros for each and every digit. But do not forget to place a decimal point. Next question is 48.84. Let's take our first digit. It is 4. 4 is before decimal point so it is in the place of tens 8 is in the unit place and 4 is in the tens place so the value of 4 is 4 and we are going to write 0 for 8 0 point 0 0 then let's write the value of 8 here. Or you can write it as a 40 also. Its place value is 8 is in the unit place. Write here 8. Then decimal point and we can write it as 8.00 or only 8. Now, let's take another 8. Its place value is, write 0 for 4, then again 0 for 8, then place here a decimal point, and 8. Its place value is 0, 0 0.8. Now, fourth place value Write 0 for 4, 0 for 8, place your decimal point and 0 for 8. And then we are going to write your 4. So here first place value is 0 0.04. Now our third question is 72 point zero five. Let's write the place value of 7 here. 7's place value is 7 is in the tens place. So its place value is write the number first and then count how many digits after that number place zeros. Don't forget to put here decimal point. Write 0 
for 2 place here decimal point and 0 0 let's write 2's place value here 2.00 0. or we can write it as a 2 then 0's place value is 0 5's place value it is a 0, 0, 0, 0.05 now fourth question our fourth question is 3.4 let's write the place value of 3 here 3 is in the unit place because it is before the decimal point so the place value of 3 is 3 point zero or we can write it as three then let's write the place value of four here four is after the decimal point so we can write its place value as write zero four three then give here decimal point and then we have to write four here so the place value of four is 0 0.4 now fifth question now fifth question the question is 0 0.59 here the place value of 0 is 0 it is in the unit place then 5's place value is 0 0.5 and 9's place value is 0.09 look it's very easy you just have to give a decimal point at appropriate place let's practice it very well and don't forget to subscribe my channel if you are new see you in next video thanks for watching this video thank you